Nick speaking. Right, there you go, my boy dragon finished, painted, all done. So I really hope you like him. I will put some still pictures up at the end of this uh, little video clip, uh, let you have a closer look. But um, yeah, I'm very happy how he's come out. So what I did first, I did a few uh, test uh, runs with this little leftover piece that I had from the model with the arms. Um, just, just basically got a rough idea of how I was going to do it, and then I went straight in, worked out pretty well from the off. Uh, but I basically based him with uh, Rackarth Flesh. I then went in and highlighted with Pallid Witch Flesh. Uh, did some Devlin Mud Wash, more highlights of this. Uh, another uh, watered down wash, done a bit of highlight with some um, uh, bleach bone. And then a very, very small final wash over the top. Just built the colours up um, so that the top area here is actually much lighter than down below. Um, so just built the highlights up really. Um, I printed out a higher quality image um, of what I had just so I could much match the colours in. Um, and the tones you can see, there's, there's various tones from really dark to really light. Um, so yeah, I just tried to match that in as best I could. I did decide on the lightning here though, rather than go for white, um, I matched the lightning into his chest piece. Uh, because I just thought it was just sort of, I mean, why would he have this uh, lightning thing in here? So for me, um, that's like generating the lightning and then it comes out as a hand. So yeah, that's what I went for. The cloak I did in what I call my Blood Angels Red. So if I was ever going to do Blood Angels Army, this is how I'd paint them, although I would do more highlights. Uh, but basically I went in with um, Mechrite Red blade Base and then Bow uh, Red Wash. I would uh, then I then did um, Devlin Mud um, Wash, although a watered down version, back over with Bow, um, and then a highlight, uh, roughly three layers of highlight of Blood Red just to build that um, highlight up. So yeah, very happy how he's come out. I really hope you like him. Just going to get my other Satan out so you can see them. There we go, that's the Nightbringer, which is obviously what this model is based on. And quite interesting, really, that the Deceiver is a lot smaller than Nightbringer. I didn't really realise that, because I was using the Nightbringer as my sort of base model. Um, but yeah, this is actually quite a bit smaller. But still, he matches in quite well. Um, I plan to have lots of fun with these. I'm going to use the Deceiver with um, Worldscape. This guy here, he's going to be my close combat one. And this one with the lightning on, he's going to have the Thunderbolt uh, lightning attack. So he's going to be the shooty one. So lots of fun to come. Um, I'll make a video on my army list, etc. later on. Um, but for now, I'm going to go straight into the pictures, let you have a closer look. And yeah, let me know what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching.